Hello, Ray Wheatley for Fried News. I'm here with two-time world champ, Ludmore Nadu, and who's also one of Australia's leading lawyers. How are you, Ludmore? Ray, it's always a pleasure talking to you. How are you? Very good, Ludmore. Ludmore, we look like we're going to have probably the biggest fight we've ever had down under, mate, when Manny Pagio defends his WBO welterweight title against Jeff Horn on July the 2nd, Suncorp Stadium. How do you see that fight, mate? That's an interesting battle. Well, I think this is going to be one of probably, you know, um, one of the biggest fights ever held in Australia. And my understanding is they've already sold 20,000 tickets already. That's right. Um, look, I, I think this is great for Australian boxing, and I think it will be great if uh, Horn could win the fight. But, you know, he's, th he's coming up against a legend. You know, um, I, I personally, I don't think, um, you know, um, Horn, you know, can beat Manny Pacquiao at the moment. I think... Um, uh, Manny Pacquiao, despite you know the, the the losses he had in the past, he's always come back strong, and I still think he's still got a lot left in the tank. So um, personally, I think um, Manny Pacquiao will will prevail. So uh, twelve round decision or inside Look, the distance? Manny Pacquiao, you know, is one guy that can all he can punch as well, and um, Juan can punch as well. So you know, I think it all depend on you know how uh, Horn approaches the fight. Uh, if he wants to get into a brawl with Manny Pacquiao, I think that could be a bit too dangerous for him. Um, again, you know, like I said, you know, <laughs> Manny Pacquiao is still slick. And, 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 and by saying this, you know, I'm not underestimating you know, um, uh, Jeff Horn. I think he's proved himself as a, you know, as a fighter, you know. And um, not only as a fighter, you know, he's one guy you know, I think he's a good role model for boxing, and that's why I say, you know, if he could win this fight, you know, it would be great for boxing, it would be great for Australian boxing, but I just think he's not ready for, for, for Manny Pacquiao. Mm. Now, Manny Pacquiao in 2012, as you know, like more was stopped uh, by, by bad knockout, Juan Manuel Marquez. You don't think that can happen again? Well, like I said, you know, he got stopped before, but he came back strong. That's you know, right. And that, that, you know... That tells you a lot about a fighter. You know, some fighters once they get knocked, knocked out, that's the end of them. Some fighters they get knocked out, they come back strong. And Manny Pacquiao is one of those fighters. You know, he got knocked out really bad, but he came back strong, and that's why I believe he still got a lot left in the tank. And I believe I just think um, the timing of the fight is just not right for Horn. I just think Manny still got a lot left in the tank, and I think um, you know he he easily outsmart Horn. Yeah. Well, once again, Lovemore, thanks very much for your time, mate, and the best of luck for the future. Thank you, Ryan. Cheers, Lovemore.